Hey guys, Attic Cyclist here with an unboxing video of the new uh, S-Works Fast Track uh, 29 by 2.35 tire. So they actually went out to a uh, 2.35 from a 2.3 in the larger version from the previous, previous uh, iteration. And I uh, was anxious to get my hands on this. Uh, I've been running the ground control uh, in the front of my specialized Epic and uh, running the original Fast Track in the rear, which I absolutely love this tire. I thought it was a little too light, um, you know, to have in the front, you know, I'm more of a, uh, call it like a down country slash aggressive rider uh, on this XC bike. So I always wanted something with a little bit more shoulder knob. Um, but again, this ground control came in at over like 870 grams. Uh, the new Fast Track has a claim weight of 615. So we're gonna weigh it today to see how far off uh, it is from its, uh, its claimed uh, online stated weight. Um, but just looking at the tread design, it's definitely a lot burlier. The shoulder knobs um, uh, do look a little sturdier uh, and they're more of a block design opposed to, you know, a very thin, thin, I would call it very kind of short for a uh, shoulder block. I mean, these tires are very fast rolling, but impressed with them. Uh, so I'm hopeful that this will be a great front tire. And also, you know, to save, you know, uh, over 200 grams, on the uh, on the rolling rolling weight is uh, pretty pretty significant. Um, this bike weighs in at uh, 23 pounds uh, with pedals, with how it's specced. Uh, so let's just get this thing on the scales here. So stated weight online is 615 for the 2.35, and it comes in at 635. All right, so not too far, not too far. But again, it's a it's a huge huge. Uh, a difference from the 860 870 gram ground control I've been running on the front so uh, just looking at this tire uh, you know it seems to have a pretty pretty aggressive tread design you know the the knobs are actually pretty tall uh, compared to what I've been used to uh, at least on the rear fast track so um, the sidewall it's pretty thin pretty thin it's gonna be pretty supple hopefully uh, you won't have too much seeping out of the sealant on there. Um, so I'll, I'll give a ride report. Um, just uh, wanted to get an unboxing and weigh-in video here. There's not too many videos that kind of give you a little up close and personal, which is a word I've been using lately to describe the videos from my Factor 1 and Factor Rostro. Um, you can see the, the side knobs there. So pretty excited to use this. This should do just fine in my local trail system here. So and they use the T5, T7 compound. So I believe it was T5 in the center, uh, a little harder, uh, faster rolling. And then they use the T7 on the shoulder knobs or lugs. Uh, so the dual compound on this tire. I think the other regular fast track just runs a T5 throughout. So, yep, just a little unboxing video. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments. And uh, please like and subscribe as I'll be doing an update on the ride report with these in the next week and a half or so. And uh, pretty anxious to, uh, to get this thing on the, on the bike and rolling in the trail. So appreciate the views and uh, be well. Thank you.